this has been an interview that I've been trying to get for quite some time. You've kind of piqued my interest with your, I guess, your relationships with a lot of celebrities that, you know, we follow some celebrities that are not here. Um, you are a former death row artist. You go by Halicia. So my name is Halicia. Halicia. Choice, but my um rap name is SKG. But listen, let's um let's get into it because I, I kind of want to know a little bit about your background because, like I said, you have history um, with with Nipsey, mm-hmm. uh, Left Eye. Mm-hmm. Uh, I think you know Big U, Wack One Hundred, all of those guys. <laughs> How did your record deal come along? It was okay. like I'm a recorded demo. And um, I did that. I got out, mm-hmm. went hard on the music and the raps that I wrote in Juvenile Hall while I was fighting my cases, the raps that got me signed to death row. But Suge really took care of me besides that. Like, money was no problem. My condos, my cars, nothing was a problem. Suge was the first person, the first man who really took care of me, knew my situations, helped me out. Um, was he fucking you? No, I never fucked Suge. And everybody thought that because my name is SKG, Suge Knight, girl. I've never fucked him. I never looked at him like that. Left eye was sleeping with him and Shalay, that was her husband at Wait the time. Wait a minute, hold up. <laughs> Left eye? Mm-hmm. And that's why we got into it, because she thought I was sleeping with him. And Wait a minute. You got into it with Left eye? Mm-hmm. While you were on the label? Mm-hmm. We had a fight. A physical fight? Mm-hmm. Where Reggie and Hutch had to come and intervene. You know, you and I have had some past conversations. You know Nipsey. Y'all grew up around the same area? Nipsey came around me in like 07, um, 08 when he was first coming out and he was working his projects, um, his mixtapes and albums and stuff like that. Okay. And I was working at a radio station in L.A. called 93.5 K-Day. So me and Nipsey being from the same neighborhood, I wanted to help him. So when what, what happened, I guess, between you and Nipsey that caused, I guess, your relationship to go from a positive one to you pushing this music to... A negative one. I'm sorry. I don't even want to. I get so mad about this hush shit. I get very upset. Hey, Jasmine, can you bring uh, some some <laughs> shit, please? 